Okay, um, all right, as you can see here, I have everything set up. So first thing first is the um, uh, hot water. I have the T-shaped connector with the um, pressure and uh, a temperature relief valve. If anything happens, pressure too high or temperature too high, it will go, uh, the water will um, come out. So connect this to, uh, with a pipe to outside your RV. And this is the inlet water, cold water. So I just connect to the, um, uh, the hose. Uh, look at this. This is the battery I use. This is a 12V battery. Uh, but of course, in the RV, you just connect to the RV battery, uh, which is uh, 12V and then uh, DC. And the second thing is the uh, digital controller, uh, digital controller wired. Uh, so look at it here. So it's connected and it's powered on. Um, and of course, this is the gas inlet. Um, it, it connect to my gas tank on the bottom. Uh, as you can see, I have the gas pipe regulator there. Of course, that's very needed uh, when you use the LPG and uh, the, um, the propane gas. And I'm gonna show you uh, when I turn this on. So first thing first, you turn on the gas. Yeah, and then I need to turn on the water. Um, I'm gonna leave, uh, go around here and uh, show you how this works. So I have, like I, I said, I have everything connected and I have the um, uh, remote control here and uh, this is the shower head. And just like if you turn on your sink uh, faucet or the shower head, uh, you know, that means you need the hot water. Then supposedly the machine start to burn, right? Uh, and uh, heat up the water. So uh, first thing, make sure you have this uh, switch on. So make sure this is on. Uh, turn this on otherwise it may not work and uh, next thing is I'm gonna show you um, of course um, right now this is on uh, okay actually I can I can open this later to show you the details the inside uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch this on and uh, turn on okay this is a 120 this is a, uh, this is the uh, temperature i would like to set and i'm gonna turn on my uh, shell head i want to show you this way okay um uh, let me see okay and you can you can hear it pull that's the uh ignition and so right now uh, the water is heated and i can feel this is a hot the hot air the vent uh, coming out here um, and then if I feel the water or even you can see here oh it's, it's hot it's hot and the water is a lot so this is very uh, very useful and a very uh, easy to use so you see you turn on turn on the uh, controller or turn on the sink it will automatically turn on the machine so right now it's 120 122 123 this is how you set up your uh, temperature um, I can feel this the hot air and also the hot water. So what if I turn off? I can turn off this way or I guess just turn off my water uh, shower head. So I'm going to turn off the shower head. Okay, the shower head is off. And you can see the air still coming out because you need to cool down. And um, what's going to happen is in a few seconds it will uh, shut off automatically. Okay, that's that's off, and I'm, I'm going to turn on again, but this time I'm going to open this, so maybe you can see what's uh, going on inside. Um, so inside this is the air vent, you know, the hot air coming out, and, uh, um, you know, if you can see that that's the, you know, uh, copper brass, and uh, that's the heat uh, exchanger, and that's the machine used to burn the gas, heat up the water. So let me turn on, turn on the water again. Okay, it's on. Okay, okay. You can hear that. That's the automatic ignition by the uh, uh, by the battery. So you can see the water uh, temperature is going up. 120 now. 120 now. Okay. How about we go 123? That's high. Or okay, I think that's too much. So I'm gonna turn down uh, the water uh, temperature to 110. Okay, this is how you control it, and you can you can you can you can still feel it. All right, so this is how the uh, machine works. 
it's quite easy, uh, quite easy to set up. You know, you have only gas, um, battery, and also water in and out uh, to connect, and then you're good to go. So, I'm gonna turn this off. Okay, once I turn off, you can see the air actually coming out even, uh, even more because they need to cool down the machine. Okay, it's done. Thank you for watching.